I love in eating international food. Uh, we would just be eating fish and chips probably <laughs> if we didn't have uh, multiculturalism in this country. If I see your culture, if you see my culture, we enjoy the life together. So, to me, we have a lot to provide to the country. When I look around today, I see a lot of stalls with a lot of food, a lot of uh, different foods, a lot of diverse foods. Behind every food, other than just the taste, there's actually meaning behind it, uh, whether you eat Asian or Indian, um, all the different flavors, it, there's a story behind it. And it's about humanity. It's, it's more than you're from here and I'm from there. It's about we're all in it together and it's priceless. Ah, okay. I'm cooking the chicken, the lamb, and uh, the cow stomach. This stomach is uh, from the butcher, and he wash it. It's a cow meat, stomach meat and the intestine. This one is a sauce, tomato sauce. So this tomato sauce, I have the onions, and tomato sauce, and the oil, and garlic. Um, we are uh, cooking the Northeast Africa. Um, cook, which is uh, basically Eritrean cook, and the Eritrean cook is uh, spicy, very tasty, very unique from a lot of uh, cultural uh, foods. All our dishes is very rich in red onion, chili, tomato, garlic, and ginger. Yeah, Musidal is Liberian and Guineans from West Africa and Sierra Leoneans. Yeah, so we all came together here and united here together because we all speak the same language. So yeah, we try to, you know, bring our cultural food and sell it to Australians, people. Yeah, we do have jollof rice with mixed vegetables and we have um, brochette. Brochette is in French. That is um, cow meat, yeah, cow beef. Yeah, we mix it with capsicum and onion. We put salt and pepper on it. Yeah. Sri Lankan food is, uh, we basically eat uh, curry. It's, it's not exactly the same as uh, Indian food. Uh, our curry is uh, spicier and we tend to eat more seafood as well because we are surrounded by sea from all sides. I mean, I came back in 91 and if I compare uh, Australia 91 to now, now it's definitely way more colorful than uh, back then and you feel at home. Multiculturalism to Australia, I'd say, is the backbone. It's um, it's what this country is built on, uh, all the way back from the Irish, English. Um, then you can say, yeah, Indians, Asians, Africans, everyone. It's a multicultural country, and it's it's the backbone. It's how it's held together.